Hello everyone, it's Alexis here, and today I'm going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be talking about kind of pranks and stuff, and this may seem a little strange. However, I want to preface this video by saying I don't dislike pranks, I just dislike pranks and bad taste. I hope you guys are doing well, and today I'm basically going to be talking about something of one of my favourite YouTubers, Optimus, talked about, and it's basically really bad pranks, where it's specifically fast food drive through restaurants where they deliberately like screw around with the workers so they can't really get their jobs done and it upsets them and I actually work in fast food at the moment so as like a job so this kind of hit me on a personal note and made me really mad when I saw it like I understand pranks and sometimes pranks can be amazing there are lots of good like pranks about you know fast food restaurants where it's actually pretty good and it's actually really funny like i think the one with the skeleton's funny it's an old one he like drives by and he's got a skeleton in the front of the car it's very creative but it doesn't really mess up the drive through itself and it's just a little pick me up where both sides get a laugh and you know that's actually really good i really like those kind of pranks and the cute ones of like kittens and puppies and stuff However, you get a lot of these horrible people who think it's really funny to screw around with workers. Like, for example, in the clip you're about to see, there's like, they, the person at the drive through window hands them their drink and they keep pretending to drop the drink or squeeze the cup and say, oh, like, oh no, something's wrong with the cup. Like, you know what I mean? And they basically ruin the order. So the people working there have to go, like, replace it, which, although it sounds funny on paper and you get a lot of kids who would laugh at it, when you're actually working at like a place like that, you don't, you actually realize how annoying it is because fast food jobs are extremely stressful and basically everyone's doing multiple jobs at the same time. So to have someone deliberately messing something up and slowing down everyone in the store, it kind of really messes everything up. And I, uh, and I apologize if my voice sounds a little off today. Like, my throat keeps getting, like, better and then sore again. So I apologize for my weird voice. But pretty much, I just want, want to keep talking. I just wanted to mention that. But, yeah, it's a really scummy thing to do. And it's really annoying me. And, yeah, I'm just going to play some clips so you can kind of see what I'm talking about. So I'm going to play them now. Thank you. Oh. What's wrong with your cup? Okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, man. He gave me the first one and the thing exploded and he gave me the next one and it dropped right out of my hand. I guess it's all over my hand. Oh. I got it, I got it. Oh, what's wrong with your cup? I it. I what? The cup. We have another uh, half, mi empty. half empty milkshake from Jack in a Box that we don't need. Do you need it? I don't need that. I don't need it. I'll be right there. <laughs> I'll be right there. <laughs> <laughs> stop. Right stop. 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 <laughs> Here, I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need that. Oh. 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 I don't know how many clips I put there, but it's definitely going to be enough to show you what's going on. I'm going to use the same ones Optimus used, so yeah. Thank you, Optimus. I appreciate it. He doesn't know I'm making a video and using his... They're not his clips, technically. You know what I mean. But yeah, thank you regardless, because I got them from your video. Shout out to Optimus. I'll leave a link to his channel in the description. He's a really, really cool YouTuber, and he's one of my favorites. He just talks about general internet stuff, and but he seems like a really nice guy. He talks about like games and all that, so he talks about like internet and gaming stuff. So if you like that, make sure to go check him out. He's got a lot of subs, but you know, he's cool. But anyway, 
like, as I was saying, it's like, I like pranks and stuff. They're really fun. But some people have, and especially younger people, really have to think about things when they do pranks. Like, I know they do it for YouTube money, but that's just really scummy in my opinion because they're actually affecting people and they're affecting, like, the business that they're kind of you know, messing around with, because when you really think about it, if they keep messing multiple orders up, people are waiting behind them, and then people can get mad that they're waiting for so long, and they could direct that anger towards, like, the people working, and then it could either put them in danger, or it could mean that the people who are just trying out the, um, restaurant for the first time, they might not come back, so it actually affects business, and it also affects the people working, because they have to make multiple drinks, and it costs the company money, so... As I work in a place like that, I kind of know how annoying it can be. It's also extremely awkward and unfair on the people working because not the majority of people that work in restaurant jobs don't get paid a lot of money and some of them don't even want to be there. So I'm not saying me, like I'm there because I want to work, but you know, it's like, it makes them wonder like what the point is when people don't appreciate what they're doing and I just deliberately messing everything up. So yeah, it's just a real pain and I just wanted to make this video to kind of tell people to stop doing like mean pranks and they will already think about what they're doing before they do it because it can affect people and for the person that they're pranking it could also have an effect on them mentally because they could think they're either being targeted or that they're not respected and I know being a fast food worker isn't the most glamorous job but a lot of people just want to make their money and enjoy their life and when people just come around and take I was gonna say something kind of rude then but they basically make fun of them and obviously don't care about their time and they're just doing it to get a kick out of it then i think it's really bad like i said i don't mind pranks which basically are good for both sides and don't affect business like little funny pranks every now and again are okay and i honestly don't mind that and i find them entertaining it's just the ones where people don't care about others it just really irks me but anyway i hope i got my point across and i hope you guys enjoyed this like different video. I like to experiment when I do videos so if you like this kind of video make sure to hit the like button in the face and also make sure to like the video. Oh yeah I just said that oops. <laughs> but anyway make sure to hit the subscribe button that's what I meant to say and hit the bell so you get notifications for whenever I upload a video. Also I have a discord if you want to join it the link's in the description as well as the link to my patreon if you want to support me more directly like financially uh the link's in the description in my channel bio with all my other links to my social medias like my twitter so yeah ba basically if you want to support me on patreon it's all down there and it would i'd really appreciate it because it would be great to do more videos all the time and i also want to give a big shout out to shadow e1 he's my five dollar patreon at the moment and he's been doing it for five months so he is absolutely amazing i actually speak to him on instagram a little bit so i do kind of know him but i want to thank you so much oh my phone's going off <laughs> but anyway i hope you have a great day shadowy one and i also hope you guys watching have a great day i really appreciate you spending your time here and anyway yeah thank you but also don't forget everyone subscribe to me because i'm definitely 18